what up tube is this is super Dell, and a major major upgrade is happening again a few weeks ago the nvidia shield released the shield experience upgrade 9.0.0 now it turned your android 9 nvidia shield into android 11 which caused some major 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 issues with us using the nvidia shield now one of the main issues was the plex server all right the plex server people you know who set their plex up using the nvidia shield was unable to access their content all right it was all type of problems one of the issues i have with my shield is it was not recognizing my external hard drive which i have the adaptive storage so a lot of my applications are on the external hard drive and what i will have to do is reboot my nvidia shield pretty much every day all right so they just released the shield experience upgrade 9.0.1 now listen look if you update it is at your own risk i would say you might want to wait a couple days read the comments see what people are saying i do not have my um my plex um server um you I'm, i don't use the plex server on the nvidia shield so as far as a client yes i can see my content um but as a server i don't i didn't use it so if you're you know i would just say wait and read the comments all right so if you do not see the shield experience upgrade 9.0 dot one one thing you can do is go up here to the settings which i would do right now go to the settings and then go uh let me see go down to device preference and then go to the about and then right here it says system upgrade you can always check this way and then say check for upgrade and it would tell you right here it tells you to check for upgrade and as you see it will pop up now when you do this you can just go over here and say what's new so let's go over here and let's just see and it says this is a patch release to shield experience 9.0 and resolves issues in the previous release including resolve plex media server issues fixed storage permissions on media players file browser and emulator apps fixes stutters when playing interlace content all right so it does and this is the main one right here all of this under what's new in nine you know dot zero that's old all right um i would tell you before you do it definitely watch my video and read the comments it's very important that you read the comments below to see if anyone else is having any issues and if you come across this video um, and you're having issues please please leave a comment you know that way we can share important detail information all right we can all help each other out all right so i will be doing the update all right so just in case uh i'm gonna just hit the home button for right now but i just wanted to show y'all just in case you do not see this right here at the shield experience you can always check for it so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go up here to details let's go to details and i'm gonna hit um download and install all right and it's going to go through look like it's a little bit um over a gig right here so we gonna see it we're doing it real time there's no hidden anything um but again please if you're if, even after this upgrade if your your plex is still not correct on your nvidia shield and i'm talking about the nvidia shield you're using your plex and your external drive and you're using the nvidia shield as a server all right not as a client a client is you can you know the nvidia shield um another android box a google um a chromecast with google tv all of those devices are clients all right and you may have a mini pc or somewhere uh, 
you know you have another device that's actually putting out the content you know to share the plex um, on many other devices all right but if you use it as the main server definitely please leave that information in the comments so we can always we can all share the information so we're almost done and again we're doing this real time guys we're doing a real time we're going to walk through it and see it you know it's just that you know the nvidia shield is one of the most powerful um, devices out here when it comes to performance but there are issues after major updates and upgrades all right so it's downloading right now it's going into it all right so it's saying choose what to allow video players to access i don't know about all of that but let's just hit continue <laughs> prepare to install shield will restart shortly so that was odd. That was odd that one media player. So something is going on. We're going to see. And I may pause this video just in case if it's taking too long. But again, this is supposed to fix pretty much everything. All right. So my screen went black. You got the NVIDIA icon right here. All right and now it's upgrading your shield experience so it looked like it's moving pretty pretty fast i did know right here i know in the last um upgrade uh it did take a little bit of time right here so i'm gonna pause this video until it get to the end all right all right guys um it's it's been about two minutes so we're almost to the end um, if you come across my channel and you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. Also, click that bell icon and select all. That way you get notified anytime I drop any content or go live on YouTube. All right. Let's go. Let's go. All right. So we got the NVIDIA icon again so again this is supposed to fix a lot of bugs like a lot of major issues with the nvidia shield all right so hopefully this fix my problem when i get off work and i come down here to this nvidia shield um you know hopefully and i'm saying hopefully um i don't have to continue to restart my nvidia shield it just makes all of my applications disappear and I have to reboot every time in order for it to read my external hard drive. So hopefully this is doing it. All right. Look like we got a little something going on. And again, I will go back into the settings. So it says right here. All right. So it gave that little patch thing. I don't know. All right. That was kind of different. All right kind of different i don't know if it took or not <laughs> it just brought me back to the original page so let's do this let's hit the home all right all right it's telling me to hit the back button i'm hitting the circle and it's telling me to hit the back all right for whatever reason all right but now i'm saying i hit the back button that says finishing upgrade uh, here we go all right all right i'm seeing a few of my my applications up here um so far it is it must be still loading guys because it's a little bit shaky right now but i do see my applications up here it do say uh, my drive was reconnected So I do see that. I know my son will call as soon as I do a, a video. And so it is a little bit choppy right now. As you see, it's delayed a little bit. All right. But I'm going to go into my settings. All right. It is a little bit choppy. All right. So let's go into um, 
device preference let's go into the about it is still right here on um, version 11 all right so and it did take right down here at the bottom so it's still at a version 11 and it is on the 9.0.1 version all right so we do see that so that's a good thing all right but let's see all right it seems like everything is kind of moving on so it was stuttering a little bit but everything seems to be running right now um i should be able to get to my uh my external drive but there is a delay there i mean it seems like it is kind of like the land all right so let me just do um device preference let me go into my storage all right so as you see it right here i, got, I see my seagate that's connected so um everything seems to be moving all right it's moving way better than when it first started up so that's a good thing all right so that is a good thing all right that is a good thing all right so um again this is the experience definitely check it out guys see if it works for you um go from there uh it seems like it's fixed but uh, we will know shortly all right again if you're still experiencing some issues please leave it in the comments guys so we can share information and data amongst each other and um, go from there but this is super dale guys i'm getting ready to sign out y'all be safe out there and i will talk to you on the next video peace i'm out